lastly lashes Woo -woo. this is our first video and we are so excited to be here we did all face products under five dollars mm -hmm. including the brushes which which is very rare is really cool. <laughs> yeah. um we are so excited that you're here watching our videos today if you want to continue to watch our videos if you're excited to be here with us just like we're excited to be here with you subscribe down here below we also have a giveaway coming up so you should um, definitely subscribe to get more information about the giveaway and also go to our social media pages we're on Instagram and snapchat we just um, want to teach everybody how to do everyday makeup with yes. everyday prices, everyday budgets. We're just really excited to be here with you guys. <laughs> well, anyways, all of our products are under $5 and you should keep watching. Including brushes. Yeah. So yeah, we're going to get started with the Wet n Wild Coverall. Oh God, I went the wrong way. Coverall <laughs> primer like that. It doesn't like really fill your pores or anything, but it does give a really smooth base and I really like that. And then we're, because we can only find one primer, we're using the same primer, but most of the products we're gonna be using, we're using separate products. So I'm so. gonna do my foundation with the NYC Get It All Foundation. Get it all, yeah, get it all. Get it all. It's a stick foundation. And I'm gonna be using a oh my God, it looks foundation dark. from Rimmel. It's called Stay Matte Liquid Mousse Foundation in Light Ivory. Oh yeah, my color is light but this does not look light. <laughs> and what we're gonna be using for our beauty blenders are these Dream Blenders by Maybelline. I'm like literally beating the crap out of my face. <laughs> this blender is not soft. No, not even a little bit. It's like really stiff. And I, I thought the handle would be cool, but I kind of don't like it. Yeah. Like, I feel like I almost don't have as good of control. Let's go, coat two. <laughs> <laughs> got on my pants. Oh my God. I got it. Okay. I may just say, like, screw it and go with my fingers. I feel like that's a great idea. I'm, gonna I'm do doing that. Thing. Sorry. Big no from us for this, because it's terrible. I'm gonna move on to concealer yep. because me too. We're, it is what it is, you know. Yep. Um, this is the NYX Above and Beyond Full Coverage Concealer in the color Fair, and it's in a little pot. This <laughs> this concealer is a match perfection by Rimmel in the color Fair. I never use my fingers for my foundation. Ever. Yeah, I don't either. I'm always Ever. using a blender. So that's kind of a problem. All right, well, I'm gonna move on to powder. Okay. I put concealer all over my face. So. And I actually do really love this product. That's one of the reasons I really wanted to use this, but I normally use it with a good foundation. So we'll see, but it's the Stay Matte Long Lasting Pressed Powder. And then I got the color Transparent. Well, I mean, we're pretty fair. Please, with our freaky half ginger skin. Yeah, half gingers, what's up? If you're half Holla. ginger, you should comment. If you're full ginger. Yeah, if you're full ginger, you should comment. We love gingers. Our dad is a ginger, yeah. so. Okay, I'm gonna be using the banana powder side of the contouring palette. Contouring palette contour is what it says. Is it really? Yes. <laughs> uh, it says it's in caramel toffee by Wet n Wild. So I'm gonna go for this. Oh my god, I'm yellow. You are pretty yellow. Mine's, my makeup doesn't look awful. I mean, it's not the best coverage I've ever had, but. I mean, the powder definitely fixed the patchiness for my face. It's not my color, not my color, even a little bit. match pretty well for me, actually. Let's brow it up. I'm gonna use the uh, NYX eyebrow pencil in medium brown. I've never used okay. this one. I Give really wanna, brush. oh my God. It's broken. <laughs> oh my God. I'm using the e.l.f. eyeshadow palette with the four, the base lid crease line thing. And it's in tantalizing t <laughs> <It's> orange. <laughs> um. Mine is a tantalizing taupe oh my palette. God, it's totally orange. By Elf. I'm gonna be using the darkest brown. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh no. Mm -mm, child. It, like, my brows are so red. 
I'm gonna move on to bronzer okay. and I'll just fix my brows in I'm a second. I'm still working on mine. Matte bronzing powder and it's in the color natural. And it says it's perfect for lighter skin types. Hmm. So I'm also using, I'm literally using like every wet and brush they have because I love them and they're awesome. But I'm using their contour brush for this. So, oh, and look at this pattern on here. It's so beautiful. Pretty good to pay off already. Let's do it. Oh my God, it's orange. <laughs> it's everything I'm putting on my body orange. Ooh, ooh. Hey girl. Girl, bronzing it up. Hey girl. Goyle. You got that bronze eyebrow going. <laughs> Let's do a little bit of bronzer under my bottom lip too. For a really pouty look. Mm. Alright, I'm stealing it. I'm gonna do the same thing she did. Um, and use the brown and the angled brush just to fix it. I'm probably not gonna do it as oh my god. And now I'm going in to um <laughs> to like seal my eyebrows with the Essence Make Me Brow Gel. Mascara, that's what it says, but it's just because I have a little spoon. So here I go. I'm gonna work on my cheeks. It's literally a blush brush. It's by Wet n Wild. The blush I'm gonna be using is by Wet n Wild again. It's called Rose Champagne. Ooh! Hello, girl. Mm. Start with. <laughs> Um, an eyeshadow base, which I normally don't do this, but I thought, why not? And it was under $5, so I'm gonna do the Essence I Love Color, color, Intensifying Eyeshadow Base. This looks really runny, but I'm gonna do it. Cause when I fix the bulk spot in my brow. When you YouTube, you YouTube. That's, that's right. Pretty good saying. I'm proud. So what I'm using for my highlight is by e.l.f. It is in the color Moonlight Pearls. I'm gonna let my eyeshadow base like dry a little bit and I'm gonna work on blush. I got the Makeup Revolution Matte Blush in the color Nude and it's really pretty. It's kind of bright, but The only we'll place I highlight is right above my cheekbone. I don't like all the crazy. Let's <laughs> get it fixed. A clown. Oh my god. Yes. Look at my cheeks. <laughs> Holy crap. I don't know how to help you. Oh my god. I'm just gonna blend. This you know that this is a perfect thing to teach you guys. If you're ever in a panic, just blend. Blend the crap out of yourself. Okay. okay. <laughs> oh. It's almost like we're related. These are the colors I'm gonna be using. Alright, I think I fixed. I'm gonna it. use the base color as the base. Except now my whole cheek is red. Oh. The whole thing. Just fixing the bottom half of my cheeks, actually. I'm not gonna start my face over. I'm using the e.l.f. liquid highlighter in Lilac Petals. I changed my mind, I'm not gonna follow the steps. <laughs> Use the crease color on my whole Actually, face. I'm gonna be smarter about this. I'm gonna put it on the back of my hand. Smell this highlighter. No, I'm scared. No, smell it. This brush is the tapered highlighting brush from e.l.f. And it's pretty. So what I'm gonna be using now is this other wet well brush. It's got kind of like a fluffier tip than the other one that I was just using to support. I got this one. Yeah. And now what I'm doing is I'm gonna take this dark color right here, the one that I used for my brows, and put it in my crease and blend it. So now I'm gonna move on to my eyeliner. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna be done with my eyeshadow. It's just kind of simple, um, but I am gonna do a little bit of a smoky smudge with this dark color. Why are you making up words? It's a smoke and a smudge. I'm doing smudgy smoke under my eyelids. My mascara I'm using is by Essence, the I Heart Extreme Crazy Volume. Good for bottom lashes, not my top lashes. No, time for my fake eyelashes. They're my favorite. If the lashes suck, the whole face is I'm actually starting to not like this mascara. I'm gonna use her, she has an e.l.f. pencil liner that she got too. I'm gonna use that to tight line my top lashes. It's a self sharpening cap. I actually kinda like this. It's not not terrible. I think I'm gonna let my mascara sit for a second and um, do a second coat, but you really have to let it dry sometimes. 
or you can be in a world of hurt. I'm gonna move on to lip, and I'm doing the LA Colors lipstick in Natural Shine, and I got this from Dollar Tree. So this is a dollar, you guys, and it's a really pretty color. Um, it's oh my god, it's broke. Look at this. <laughs> Oh my gosh, why is this happening to me? All right, well, I'm still gonna use it. Very pretty, very pretty eyelashes, look at these. Yeah, they look good. Very pretty. They look really Change pretty. Change your whole face. The whole yeah, thing. Really good. And your face doesn't look as yellow anymore either. Oh yeah, eyelashes, man. Okay. Taking my hair down. Taking my hair down. I just thought the same thing. <laughs> I'm using the uh, Wet n Wild lipstick in the color of Bear It All. Okay, cool. See, I feel like the blender that too was to blame, but I did not like my foundation. I mean, my foundation wasn't terrible, but the powder definitely helped cover the rest. Everything else, I mean, I feel like it's pretty good. I really like the mascara. I did not like my mascara. So. Did not like it. My eyebrows look good. My foundation is not a fan. My lipstick's pretty. I will be using some of the products again, I think, just to play the bomb and see if they're better. Definitely not the foundation. I really don't like the foundation. No, I'm definitely going to use the eyelashes, though. Okay, guys. We will see you next time with <laughs> like early. Lashly last shit. What? We'll see you what? next time on Lastly Lashes. Lashly last shit. <laughs>